Hi, welcome to NetIS tutorial. And today we will configure NetIS WF2411 device in repeater mode. This is the network scenario. Um, uh, we are already using access point and a router in our network, but uh, due to less signal strength, these two laptops are unable to get the internet through this DL4311 device. This is router. Okay. So uh, to extend our wireless signals. So we can use WF2411 device as a repeater so that we can extend our wireless signals uh, in our networks and these laptops can connect directly to the internet. Okay. So before doing any configurations on this uh, 2411 device, so we should have some information about this uh, access point or router, our existing router. Okay. So those informations are SSID, wireless name, what is the wireless name of this device and uh, second one is security mode encryption what is the security mode and encryption in this device and third one is wireless password what is the par password of this device okay wireless device this is a wireless password so to get this all informations i will connect my laptop uh, through cable or i can connect through wi-fi and i will open the configuration page of my router plus modem which already I am using okay so I am using NetIS the DL4311 device already uh, my modem plus router so if you are using any other vendor uh, access point or routers so uh, you need, need to call to them uh, to get these informations admin mm. This is setup WLAN and uh, my SSID. My SSID is NetIS. Uh, I will make down. SSID NetIS and uh, security I am using. WPA two AES security WPA two yes AES is encryption and the password my wireless password is Apple one two three okay now close this window. Okay, so now we have these parameters. So we will set these parameters in this repeater. So I will connect my laptop to this 2411 device. Okay, just a moment. Yeah, now. 192.168.1.1 sorry I will just reset this device Because already I have configured this repeater. So now I reset it. We will go in wireless. So first of all, we will configure this uh, repeater as access point because uh, our laptops or desktop will be connected with this uh, repeater. So we will just give a name. 
this repeater name is home repeater and uh, we will use access point and save and uh, now we will set the security the security for this repeater We will keep the by default security is password. Okay, P A W S W R D. We can change it. A B C one two three. Just a moment. One two three four five six seven eight nine. Okay, save. Yeah, successfully. And now we will make the changes these SSID security and password okay so now we will configure as a repeater mode okay this configurations we did as a access point so that our laptop could be connected with this repeater so now we will make the changes as a repeater mode wireless and uh, radio mode is repeater and we will select the SSID after, after clicking on AP scan and uh, my router name was netis right yeah netis connect connect save setting our chain successfully okay now we will uh, configure the security and password again click on network uh, wireless security and uh, radio mode now repeater and authentication was WPA2 and uh, security WPA2 AES encryption was AES and key was Apple 123 APPLE 123 save setting our chain successfully so now we can connect home repeater this was our repeater password was one two three four five six seven eight nine connected okay so now we can get the internet close the button okay thanks for watching